so, so uh, this time round, you feel that the commission does not present as much work, doesn't involve as much weight lifting, heavy lifting, as the council would have presented. Uh, it's not much because uh, we meet on a quarterly basis, unless it's very, I mean, it's, it's necessary that we go in for a little longer than two, three days. We normally meet probably every quarter in the Human Resource Committee, once a quarter, uh, maybe for one day, uh, at most two days. If no, I get you, out, let, let me just help you. What, what, what I'm saying is, you are asked to take up a position. It may not have been a full-time position, but you declined the position on account that it might have been entailed a lot of work. You now seek to join a commission which in the estimation of most of the Kenyans is a very busy commission. So is it your statement then that normally you would avoid where there is a lot of work? Mr. Kemole, it's not, I'm a very good worker. I can tell you that for, for, for a fact. If you ask anybody who has worked with me, I am a very good worker. And I think I would like to put the record straight. I was not appointed a member of council. The easy option was to help them, I mean, to accept the co-option into the Human Resource Committee of Council. I was not given an appointment as member of council. Sorry about that. But Mr. Kimoli, I am a good worker. You are and a good if, worker. If I got this position, I would, of course, ask my vice chancellor and university management to give me a leave of absence, if necessary. Uh, that's all right. When you worked at the uh, Public Service Commission for six years, did you have any interactions at all with the commission as a partner independent constitutional commission? I don't remember um, any opportunity when we had an interaction with the IBC as such, but other commissions I think we had, at least with the Gender Commission, with the, um, with the CIC, uh, with the Ombudsman, uh, with the GSC, but not with the IBC. Do you think, as an expert in public service, that there is something for the public service within the Electoral Commission? A lot, a lot indeed. In fact, uh, in the area of human resource management, in research, in uh, voter education, because we have experts in the Public Service Commission who could have helped if, it was, uh, if they needed the help. So there, was, there would be a lot to gain if they wanted that assistance, in, uh, if they wanted to. So. And let me just get this right. I, IEBC is an independent commission, just like the PSC, the Public Service Commission. Does the Public Service Commission undertake recruitment and management of workforce for the commission, for the Electoral Commission? It does not. It is an independent commission in that sense, but it does not remove the, the, the consultation or collaboration between commissions. It doesn't. We are all Kenyans. We are working for the good people of this country. And there's no reason if, of, of one commission consulting, uh, you know, if they think they need some expertise or something they want to work with another commission in, I don't think that would be a problem at all.